Hey guys, welcome back to another reaction, and today I'm here with a certain scientific real gun season two, episode twenty-two. And yeah, I just didn't upload this yesterday because um I already had re-zero. Um and since I couldn't like really finish it because I didn't have the time, I was gonna wait until yesterday to upload it. Uh so I kinda did like a half a half half and half reaction. Um, I was gonna do Railgun yesterday, but I was like, I just didn't feel like, uh, recording anymore, right? Um, so, yeah, and then Monday, it's like, I really didn't feel like, um, uploading either, so I just uploaded Demon Slayer, uh, since I already had that all pre-recorded, all I had to do was just, you know, just upload it and everything, and that was it, but, um, yeah, I'm here now, so yeah, tomorrow might be a double upload now, cause, yeah, I originally would upload these on uh, Tuesday and Thursdays now since I'm looking at ReZero, but tomorrow might be a double upload so I can have Friday free to do whatever, right? Um, and if not, then I'll just probably try and do it Friday because literally I only got like two episodes left, so yeah, might as well just finish it off. Um, but yeah, season three of Index, I don't know... If I'm going to start that, like, right away or not, because I might start it the week after next or so. I don't know. But, yeah, I don't think I'm going to probably uh, start it off straight away. But, yeah, I'm going to just deal with that later. But, um, yeah, last episode, uh, basically, we saw Nuno Taba and then basically a little bit more about, or got to learn a little bit more about Febri, right? Um, or wait <laughs> february fee okay fee i just say february um or no i think it no it's february um and then now you know me has told everybody and then you know they're helping out and stuff and then like how i says like if this happened sister's arc you know she would have had all that help um even though her friends would have known she had all these sisters or clones right um at least they helped her out right you know to at least try and um basically solve the problem with that um so yeah and then also oh yeah hold up i just thought about it why did they even need to make wait hold up yeah wait why did they need to make february like what's the point because i'm like I lo no it can't be a part of their experiment or whatever they're trying to do because they're like oh yeah she's just gonna die in a few days anyways it's like, yeah, they don't even care. So, I don't know. Um, yeah, why did they even make her? Like, <laughs> just to see if they can make some type of artificial, like, person or something? Like, but they, they don't even care about her. So, it's like, what's the point of making her? I guess they're going to show us this episode, but, um... Yeah, I hope you guys will enjoy this though. Make sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, let's get this reaction started. Okay, so okay, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. This is what. Oh yeah. Okay, yeah. We're about to. Um. Okay. Yep. She's about to ask Sarasina. Yeah. <laughs> it's like you're gonna have to comply with her, and I don't think she's gonna comply with you though. Dang. Yo. Yeah, are you okay? Yo, just face all up in the water, like, uh, okay, <laughs> whatever. Um, okay. Oh, yo. Okay, I, I, I don't think I remember her saying that, but yeah. Yo, it's true though. <laughs> Academy City really is just a bunch of tests. Yo, for real. Especially what happened with Misaka. Like, that is a big test right there. 
and um this what was it the underground they were talking about it's like yeah all that stuff that's hot uh that's happening behind the scenes like nah <laughs> that's just a bunch of tests i mean like i don't know what they're doing but you know Yo, they really let her keep that? Okay. Wait. Oh. I, I thought there was something about it. I think it was something like, wait. Wait, it was like if you had this certain color that you're lucky, and if you don't, then you're unlucky or something. Okay. <laughs> Yo, she mad because she actually believes her. Okay. Or says that she's going to believe her. Okay. No chance. I'm done talking. Tell me about Beckett's kid. You actually met with that witch Teresita? Yeah. <laughs> yo, Uri already said that witch Teresita. Okay. But yo if that's um the main reason why they made February, yo, they they're messed up for that. They made a little girl just to get attention. <laughs> Bro, what? It's like, okay, whatever. I mean, they could have easily got attention from something else, but okay. I mean, like, okay. Yo, hold up. I was about to say, isn't that the same exact thing she got on right now, but now it was white? Okay. Yeah, it was kind of different. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, hold up. That's the same thing, but nah. Oh. Yo. So, okay. I think she, yeah, she needs, okay. So that's what I'm thinking. She needs those lollipops and then she doesn't like, you know. Oh, yep, there it goes. Yo, so, okay, he's registered into Academy City or whatever, right? Okay. But, um, yeah, she doesn't basically, well, let me see, um, I'm gonna pause here real quick, but yeah, if she doesn't get the lollipops, then basically she's gonna be starting to get a fever, right, out of nowhere, like how she did, and then basically that's when it's gonna start getting worse and worse. So... I think that's what's keeping her alive, but I don't want to put it like this, but the best way to do it to extend her time is probably to wait for her to get that fever, like not for it to get too bad, but for her to get the fever and then start, you know, um, waiting like two more, like five more minutes. Then after that, give her the lollipop so you can at least extend it like by a little bit of time um but yeah i mean no matter what i guess it's still only gonna be three days um that she has left if he consistently wins top prizes at the assembly it means that he's one of the most brilliant people in all academy city yeah it's like <laughs> yo hold up was kuriko just drooling yo hold up <laughs> yeah Hold up, she was trying to get a little feel. Hold up. Um, but yeah, if she wasn't the level five, it's like, yeah, they would be friends. But it would probably be like a little different how their relationship would be, probably, right? Because, um, yeah, especially those times when Misaka would usually try and help out Kuriko. And she was like, nah, this is a job for judgment. It would probably be like, Misaka would probably be never or probably never had that type of like attitude right like yeah i can go help out um so yeah misaka would probably still be able to help out but since she's not level five it's like um she wouldn't be trying to like axe or anything right yo dang <laughs> hold up <laughs> i'm gonna say yo they are just out here just <laughs> I mean, like, it's just going crazy. All I heard was just gunshots. Okay. 
So, I'm guessing they're still experimenting on uh, level four then, or not level four, um, the ranked four, um, or the, yeah, ranked four <laughs> level five. Um, okay. Okay, so, okay, let's see. So, I'm thinking that she can, like, no matter, um, no matter how much time has passed, I feel like she can still sense where you are, right? Okay, uh, what was her name? Taki Tsuba, right, I think, um, yeah, she can, so, like, how she knew where Misaka was, no matter where she was at that one time, after all this time, oh, no, 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 Taba. Yo. But, um, yeah, it's like, no matter how much time has passed, she can still basically, um, find where you are, I guess. Yo, this dude really is smart, isn't he? <laughs> oh, okay, the credits are playing, so yeah, they're gonna continue this. Okay. Yo. So, did they force Nuno Taba to do this? Because I feel like she, because she literally just said, I have anyone else to turn to, right? So, it's like, um, they forced her to do this, right? Okay. Of course he's not gonna give it yep. <laughs> it's like we have no use for this. Yeah, they is no use. It's like they don't care whether she's alive or dead. It's like we call it jump. Oh wait, hold up. Yo, wait, what? Oh, <laughs> yeah, I thought it literally was Johnny. <laughs> uh wait, what? Hold up. Okay. We call it jump. Okay, so I guess they have something else then up in there. Hold up. Nah, I don't. Nah, I can't see the name on the other one. Um, cause you obviously you had the one with Johnny up in it, but then there's one on the right where you can't see the name on it. Um, but it seems like it's either. No, I think that yeah, someone's got gotten out of that already. So yeah. But dang, it's like, bro, you make a deal with this. It's like he already knew that you were going to try and um get someone else to help you, right? Uh, with the formula, so you could get the formula, get on out of there, and then she will seem, or she wouldn't seem suspicious, right? It's like he already knew that, or at least uh somewhat knew what she was trying to do, right? Um, and then it's like you make a deal with them. It's like, I don't know, bro. I don't think he's going to give you the formula just like that. And especially since, uh, February is like of no concern to him. It's like, if February was like literally, cause this is what I was thinking at first, actually, I, I was thinking she was a main link because yeah, that like. Well, honestly, right right now I'm thinking that pink or whatever is actually just the glass. That's not no, li that's not liquid or whatever. Um, that's inside of that capsule, right? I think that's just literally the glass. But I've, I'm thinking February, her hair. That's what was inside of the robots. So it's like she's the main link, but she's not controlling them. They're just using her hair, and um, I guess in the main lab or whatever they're controlling it yeah i think they're controlling it from uh well not the main lab because it was up in the van too uh what was it two episodes ago i think it was episode 20 so yeah um or no yeah episode 20 that was that um there was up in the van and i think they was able to to um control it while they were there so yeah it's like she has or she's like the main, 
person who's like controlling them, but she's not actually controlling them. It's just her hair, right? That they're using. And um, let's see. Oh yeah, and it seems like they're uh they're study. Their the name of their group is called Study or whatever. Um. Oh yeah, what Teresina said. That's actually true though. I think she said something like um. You can be the level five all you want, but you still don't know as much, right? Like, you know nothing, right? Because it's true. She really doesn't know anything. And um, that uh, she doesn't know how hard it is for people who aren't, like, level five to, like, basically show, like, how much work they are. Because this dude, I mean, like, yeah, they were talking about he got, like, an award... I don't know how many it was, but it was, like, a lot of awards that he got. Like, he was real smart. And you can see it right here. Like, he clearly knew uh, what was going on. And he was there. Like, you know. Um, but, yeah, I think it would probably seem a little suspicious. I mean, like, yeah. Well, no, not really. Because she did say she didn't want no surprises. Like, because it really could have been someone there. That could have been missing with the lab one, right? Um, and then just to distract them. And then after that, they sneak around, get some data and all that, you know, do this, do that. And then eventually get to the main lab, you know? So, yeah, that could have happened. But, yeah, it probably would have been a little suspicious for her to just go to the lab or be the one to go there, right? Um, basically, when they literally said that, that this lab is of no concern, like, literally, um, some security breach or whatever wouldn't even be that much, like, literally, it wouldn't even matter, because nothing's here, right, um, so, yeah, but it's like, yeah, Terracina was right, though, it's like, he got all these awards, and nobody knows about him, but a level 5 expert, it's like, Oh, yeah, there goes Toki Wadai, level 5 Railgun, right? Oh, there goes, you know, like, they don't even probably know her name. They just call her by Railgun, right? Um, So it's like, and in Connery, I think, yeah, she said it too. It's like, when you got all these espers, people with powers, you know, people who can do this, who can do that. It's like, it's hard for someone normal to stick out. Um... And basically show how much they can do. And basically that's where all the underground stuff comes from. It's like they don't know about them. So it's like it's hard for anti-skill to get any data. And um, oh yeah. And then like when Kirkle tried to see if they could uh, go and arrest this dude. Or not arrest him. But like try and um, basically get him right. And she said they didn't have enough evidence. It's, like, it's hard to do that if you're not, like, known. But someone like Railgun, like, bro, anti-skill would be able to get all types of information. I mean, like, <laughs> it's, like, it would be so easy to just uh, get her, right? Um, and then, well, Accelerator, I don't know. Because, I mean, like, he's well-known, but it's, like... I don't think he has data data because he doesn't go to school. I don't, yeah, I don't think he even goes to school. So, yeah. And he is, yeah, he has to be the same age as Toma at least, right? Yeah, I think he's, like, around high school type of age. So, yeah. Um, yeah, so he doesn't go to school. So, he really don't got no data on that. And then, honestly, nobody even tries to communicate with him or even tries to talk with him because you know they're scared of him so you know you won't have really much data on like what he likes to eat or what he likes to do um and all that right um but yeah let me see um let me see if i miss anything uh let's see no i don't think i miss anything just basically learning more about this other guy. Um, the Like the main person we've been finding out. Um, okay. So you guys can, can correct me if I'm wrong. But it's. Uh, I think her name is Taki Suba. Um, the one who can basically use her power. 
um, basically to locate someone. So no matter how far away they go, she can still locate them. Um, but I think... I think she would. I think she knew that Misaka was there, but she was like, "Nah, my mind's just probably playing tricks on me." Cause she, yeah, she was up in the pool, so you know she's probably like, "Oh, it might have just been the pool that's messing with me right now, right?" But I think it's not no. It's I mean, it's not a temporary thing. Like you, like she can do it for like a whole week. No, I think she can like literally do it as long as she wants. Like. As long as she knows who you are that's there, then, yeah, I think she'll be able to locate you no matter how much time has passed. So, it could be a whole year, and she could still, like, locate you if she, like, really tries and, um, you know, focus in on that. Um, but, yeah, I think, yeah, Taki Suba, I think that's what her name is. But, yeah, um, I think that's about it. Oh, yeah, and then the last thing is, yeah, I feel like Nuno Taba, she's been forced to do this because, yeah, I don't know. It seems like she's been forced to do this because she's over here trying to, yeah, she said Misaka's the only one she could think of. I thought she just did that because, um, I guess she wanted February to, um, you know, watch out for her or something. I don't know. <laughs> basically, I thought Nuno Taba basically, um, you know, wasn't trying or was helping them out. Uh, but it seems like she was forced because, you know, she's over here like, oh, yeah, Misaka's the only one I can find or not uh, not find out. Um, think of to help me out. Um, then you got the formula for the lollipop. So it's like. I guess, you know, you could, like, literally uh, keep on uh, multiplying that until she just has unlimited. And it's just going to be, like, medicine, right? Uh, you just have to take it once a day and then you're fine, <laughs> literally. Um, and that's not even that bad because instead of eating a lollipop, it's like you can just drink this maybe if they can do that. But, yeah, I think that's about it. Um... Yeah, I think that's about it for what I have to say. So, yeah, I want to know who this Johnny is. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm pretty sure they're going to show us next up. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this, though. Make sure to like and subscribe again. And, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.